So, according to Crow Guy and Google, today is International Beer Day. Yay! August 4th, and we're playing Brew Pub! Which can only mean one thing, that we're going to be doing something that involves making beer. I know, pretty easy to understand, isn't it? We're making beer. Cool. First things first, then, let's find out which beer we're going to be making today. Football party! I'm a regular visitor to your bar, and I love your beer! There will be a football match soon, and we plan to throw a, a watch party at my place. I don't want people to get too drunk, though, so we need something with a low alcohol percentage. Alright, cool. So I've got to find a... I mean, what can only be described as a watered-down beer. Something that doesn't quite have beer in it, just sort of some sort of beer. Okay, so 4.5... Let's, let's have a look for the weakest one, and then see if we can make the weakest... Well, I don't know. Lager's pretty weak, isn't it? 3%. And it's fairly cheap to make. We only need like light malt and magnum and then we're done. So if we put in slightly less malt or slightly less... I can't remember which way around. Is it like... Yeah, malt is the reason why it's like less of like alcohol. So let's pin up lager. Pin the recipe and go from there. And let's have a look at how much this guy actually needed of this. He wants five litres. So if we make this in a little bucket, we'll be fine. Little bucket, 5.30. Cool. Well... Oh and stop 533 we're all good right cool next uh, 810 mil of light malt extract 810 have i got a thousand oh no that's a three 810 oh before i even start that was the wrong one that's the amber we need one of those right okay cool so uh 810 five six seven eight so adding the malt is the ibu alcohol percentage is when we put the hops in i'm not sure i know alcohol's yeast isn't it uh, i need magnum hops and we're only putting two in here so it won't even, it's probably not even going to boil up that much one two i'm going to chuck that back on there and then cook for 60 seconds so technically the ibu should be pretty small I mean, when we get... It, it shouldn't even go above 10, really. I mean, we're probably looking at about, like, 10 to 20. Well, that's what the guide is, anyway. So, yeah, today we're making three beers. And these are going to be competition beers. I'm not going to be doing any serving today. We're literally just going to be doing three recipes and hoping for something to work. Why is the IBU so powerful? It shouldn't be that much. Unless it starts cooling down, like... I'm hoping it will be okay. 3% isn't too bad. 3 to 4... Five. So this should be an average pot, average being the word on it. So the SRM is the colour from the malt extract. If we would, if we were to put that down to like 700 mil, you're probably looking at a lightly weaker colour. It'll just more look like wee wee. Fantastic. Knock that off. Lager beer, lager beer, five mil. Not even a lot. One dose of five mil, and then we'll chuck this in the fridge. It takes like three days to do this. So whilst we're doing this one, the others are going to be making as well. Up there with you. That's going to be open. I need to take you and pop you in there. We're just going to go standard lager on this. I'm not going to add any flavouring to it. I really don't care. That goes on the lid. This goes in the fridge. Fantastic. Right, that's lager number one. Unpin that. Go into my tablet. All right, next is the Albatross's final test. Hey, you. I have the ultimate test for you. Prepare for me a beer worthy of a master. I want the most fancy lager you can make. So we get to make another. We get to make another lager. That's gonna be another space in the oldie fridge. All right, let's do another. Uh, actually, you know what? I unpinned the recipe, even though I need the recipe. So we need to pin the recipe once again. Confusing times. Right, cool. So I need 5.3 liters of water. A little bit too much. 5:30, exactly. Brilliant. Cool. 810 mil of lager. Right, so we've got 690. So if I drop five, six, throw the rest. Six, seven, eight, ten, throw the rest. Cool. Now, as this has to be super fancy, we have to choose three flavours that are going to complement each other. So that should be okay. Now we need magnum hops at two grams. So we need to make it. How much have I got left in this baggie? Eight. Oh, that's good enough. Yeah, we'll be fine. One, two. Fantastic. Stick that back on there. Stick this on boil for 60 seconds. Choose my flavours. I am going to have... Uh, 
is that vanilla? No, that's ginger. So mint, uh, berry, and cocoa. Oh, that's coffee. Where's cho Oh, no, I've lost crud. Okay, uh, let me just... I need to buy some up quick. We need to buy some cocoa. I need to buy vanilla as well. Order those up. And when this is... 19 minutes. Okay, we're done. I, I, I just need to quickly run to the thing. Yeah, run. Run, 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 run. Because by the time I get back, it's going to be done. Run, 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 run. So... I'm thinking vanilla, like a mint vanilla would be pretty cool. You know, we, we've never, I don't think we've ever done a mint vanilla because I've never had vanilla in the stack. So that'd be fine. And we'll stick the cocoa back over here. I still don't know what happened to the original cocoa. It probably went through the floor. Probably. All right, 47, 48, 49, 50. Yeah, we're nearly there. And then we can add three flavorings to it. And hopefully this is going to be like stardom lager. I mean, this may even be something that if it was real, I'd probably drink myself. Maybe. All I know is I would just drink alcohol. At this point, it would be, yeah, let's do this. Alcohol. Right, five grams. Done that. Five. Excellent. Chuck this in pot. Yes, that's good enough. Stick that in the sink. All good. Right, so we need 10 grams of vanilla. 10 grams of berry. Very berry. Or merry berry, depending on which way we're going on this. And then we're going to stuff it full of mint as well, just like a Thanksgiving turkey. Right, we're going to chuck that in here. And it's all good. Four days left on that as well. So let's put my ingredients back. Let's have a look. The last competition beer. And then we've got all three beers ready. We just have to wait for the extra time. We invite you to take part in our brewing contest. The rules are simple. Brew your own beer and send it the keg to us. The jury will rate the beer based on their creativity. The best one wins. So this again has to be a fancy beer. Minimum fanciness is silver. So this has to be like prime beer again. Has to be a four star. Has to be five litres. So small beer. Okay, so for the competition. Yeah, this competition. We are going to brew a lager. I need 5.3 litres of water. There we go, 5.35, fantastic. Uh, 6.90 in the pot, let's do this one. This is 5, 6, 7, 8, 10, excellent. So that's good. Magnum hops, how many have we got left? Oh, that's going in the bin then. We've only got one gram. Shooting scores! Right, next, have we got any more Magnum? I do, yes. Magnum hops, right, I need to put this down to one gram and add two. And that's all of that in there. Let's push the little magic button, turn it on, and then just wait for another 60 seconds. Fantastic. So International Beer Day. What better way to celebrate International Beer Day than to sit here and play a game all about brewing my own beers and just brewing three beers for this entire video? If you are liking these videos and you're liking the fact I'm doing the recipes right in front of you, hit the like, subscribe, and notification button below for all of the updates. Okay, here we go. Boom. Turn it off. 60 seconds on the clock. Oh, yeah. Oh, 61 minutes, sorry. 61 seconds. Okay. You need five mil of this. And just wait a second. Add that in there. Put that back up on the shelf. Drop this in the tank. Excellent. Pop this down on there. Add berry, mint, and cocoa. So technically, this should create a gold beer. And then the other ones I've done should create gold beers. Like, every single one of those are lager. Now, the reason why I'm going to just skip four days is because I don't have anything to sell. Yay me! We're skipping so much time. We need a skip button, developers. Come on! Hey, My lager's done. That's the standard one. This is with the football one. So, the football one was only supposed to be a two-star. Turns out it's going to be a five-star just because I'm bloody good at my job. That's a gold standard, so I'm gonna gear. I'm gonna call this one. Um, oh, actually, I got some. Okay, so this one is gonna be called Brad Schumark because you asked for your name to be a beer. So congratulations to you, Brad. And this one is gonna be Subject S9. So thank you very much for the names. Most appreciated. Now you will become. You will be um, competition beers. So good luck. No, I don't need to refresh. I need to do these flipping beers first. Stop giving me missions. Right, let's have a look. Which uh, Look, it's giving me like, we need to do this. I visited your bar a couple of times, really love the beer, blah, blah. Yeah, I'm, I'm not even doing these yet. I'm doing these ones. Football watch party. We'll do that one first. So, I called one of these football. So, that, that one. Cool. Quite literally, cool. Floor, stick this in there, stick this in there. Take the pipe off, stick pipe on side, put keg up in here, 
up in here up in here stick keg in here done excellent now let's go and clean the floor because apparently no one stood here for like a week my god right i'm gonna need to order some more kegs because i'm gonna run out let me just order four they'll just sit in my inventory for a bit done excellent now i've got to skip another day skip a day football watch party should be finished when we Endurance come back to being involved i don't care skip skip button what the amount of beer was too low you guys wanted five bloody liters i sent you five liters how is it less it said it needed five liters Fuck! oh that's fi it says 15 liters when did that d oh and the maximum four percent oh bum okay that's gonna take me a little bit long to do let me do this one first right albatross first off bums bums and more big bums okay brad schumark you are going into my final test i swear that it said five liters that's why i only made a five liter beer why did I think it was only five? It says 15 on the instructions. What an idiot. What a total fool. Total, total tit. Yes. Means I've got to brew another one. This time, hopefully, I won't mess it up. But I've got to skip like another four or five days just to do it. Oh my god. Bloody hell. Quest completed. I did it. That's a grand in my bank account. Thank you Thank very you. much, Albatross. By the way, this dude had a grand in his pocket to give me. It's time for the big reveal. <gasps> you probably thought that all those stories about aliens were just legends, right? Well, they're not legends. They're the truth. The Galactic Union is organizing interplanetary brewing competition. My task was to choose an Earth champ. You have shown that your planet is finally worthy of participating in these competitions. He's an alien! If nothing is holding you here, there's a button behind the parcel locker that will summon a ship for us to fly to the Galactic Brew Contest. However, what? you have to be sure that you want to do this. When you are ready, press the button. That's all I've got for you. That escalated quickly. Dude's an alien. Tablet, mission, next competition. Local Brew Association level two, except. Get rid of this one. Oh, okay, pop this down there, pop this down there, pop this on there, excellent. Pop this out here. Songs of the South. Oh, balls. I just picked up all my stuff again. Oh, why can't things be simple? Oh, look, cinnamon. Shut my fridge. Shut the fridge door. Items. Keg. Pick up hose. Put hose in there. Done. Hose goes up there. Empty that. All good. Let's chuck this in the container. And then we should be good for another bit. And then I've got to do the football beer again. Oh, nothing. oh, is that where the button is? I think that's the button. Let me skip another day. I hate skipping things. But at least I've got a grand. It means Let's I can just buy what started. I need now. <sighs> Close. Here you go. thousand dollars. Oh, I'm so rich. Congratulations! You've won the beer tournament. Beer contest award level two. Yeah, 250 bucks. Added to my inventory. I, I, have I got, oh, I have. Okay, cool. Wow, they're pretty big trophies. Yep, they're quite solid as well. I'm sticking them up there. That My trophies are going up. Oh, yeah. See, we're just the nuts nuts of this crud. Excellent. Okay, so I need to brew quite a big beer. And uh, I've got another. Look, there you go. Brewing tournament level three now. Yay me. Tony's the guy that I need to do. Minimum volume of 15 litres has to be 4% alcohol. Right, so we need my big keg on this one. My big one. So what I'm going to do quickly, I know this sounds a little bit backwards. I'm going to brew this one up now. I'm going to skip four days and then I'll bring you back in when I've finished it. And the reason why is because you don't want to sit here and watch me do this again. So, give me, I don't know, for you guys, a click of the fingers and a sip of tea. And you guys will be right back with me and I'll be finished with this mission. See in a second. I'm renaming this game. This game should no longer be called Brew Pub Simulator. It should be called Skipping Simulator, where we just keep skipping every bloody day. Ah, there we go. Maximum had to be four point uh, four percent. It was three point one, and how I did that was, I put nine grams of um, thingy in it. Oh, what's the stuff? Lager, ale stuff. This stuff, yeast. This one. Like I put nine grams of that in there and it worked out perfectly. So all good. So that's all fine. Now it's done. I can rest a little bit and be like, yay, but then uh, whilst I was doing this, I had mission after mission being popped up as well. So 
I don't really know what's going on right now. All I know is that lots and lots of missions have all popped up at the same time. So, let me just accept this mission. Because now we've got a John Sweet birthday beer and I've got to do a beer birthday as well. My God. Right, so we'll do the football one. And the football one is going to be what we're doing. I'm going to shut my fridge. Right, anyways. Off we go. And then next video, I'm going to be doing competition level three. Isn't that just fan dabby doozy? Oh, no, wrong one. That one. Donut. Well done. In there. Go. Drop. Excellent. Fantastic. Skip another day. Oh, and, and clean my floor. So, even though nobody has been in my bar for like two weeks, I literally still have to clean the floor. It's only been me standing in one spot. I love the smell of beer in the morning. Good for you. I love the smell of money in the morning. The downside is I haven't got any. Which means I've never had that smell. <laughs> there we go. Woo! Congratulations. People loved my beer. I got plush luck. And 500 doll hairs. We're making money by doing absolutely smeggle. Like, I'm literally just building... Why have I got... Oh, okay. Do I hang these on my door? Where do I hang the dice? Oh, okay. On the, on the wall. Oh, that's fantastic. Right. Can I hang those on the door frame? No. Excellent. Where can I hang these? It would be quite... Actually, I'm going to hang them next to the toilet. There you go. Oh, yeah. Excellent. Okay, cool. So that was the football mission, competition level two, and we found out that Albatross is an alien. If you're enjoying any of these videos, hit the like, subscribe, and notification button below for all other updates, because in my next amazingly fantastical video of brewing beer the right way, we're going to be doing the super dev games developer stuff because apparently I've I visited my they visited my beer a couple of times really love the beer I make it's good I'm working on a game development studio our team has just finished a long project we really need to refresh ourselves and thought the beer that was the best in order some delicious some delicious refreshing beer from you hope that's all to do yeah I'm making up words as I go along so from super dev games team. I'm pretty sure that's the guys that make this game. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see how things go. The beer must be re have a refreshing taste. So I'm going to assume at that point it has to just be fresh. So like strawberries, mint, vanilla. You know, that same sort of crap that I've been brewing for the last sort of, like, since I started playing this game. Awesome. Then I've got to do local brewing tournament level three. And I've just got to brew another beer and make it gold. So basically, the same qualities I've been giving them all the time. I've just got to brew the same sort of beer I've been doing. Maybe, let's think about this, another lager. Because that would be a good one to make, wouldn't it? Because that's really difficult. And then we've got John. I love, my beer. I love your beer you serve and was wondering if you could help your fan out. We're throwing a birthday party and would really love to have a beer that pairs with the sweet food. There will be lots of cake, like a lot. Okay, so literally the only ingredient I don't have, because I've got vanilla, I've got chocolate, I've got cinnamon, strawberry, mint, berry, blah, 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 blah. The only thing I don't have is um, rose petal. Um, and I don't have, where's the milk? I don't have beetroot. That's just, I don't even want to make beet. See, that just tastes horrible. And I have got to get this stuff, this milk sugar stuff reason why is because it's one of the ingredients I don't own. If I'm going to make anything more sweeter, I might as well own every other ingredient and then go from there with a bit of experimentation of man scientist like, right? Yeah, in it. So, that's what we're going to do. Next video, we're turning into a mad scientist making birthday cake beer. Oh man, that sounds amazing, actually. Birthday cake beer. Oh, suit you, sir. So, rose petal. I'm never going to use rose petal. I might use the milk stuff, the lactose, whatever that crud is. I'm never going to use beetroot stuff because why would you use beetroot in a beer? That's disgusting. So, the birthday beer, I'm probably going to just brew for an APA. Um, and then we'll probably make this like chocolate, mint and strawberry because they seem to go together quite nicely. Um, and then we'll go from there for everything else. But if you guys have enjoyed this video, hit the like, subscribe, notification button below for all the other updates. I know these, like, the I'm going to assume these last couple are going to be like not very much focused on what I'm serving in front of house, but getting through all these tournaments and missions and everything else is all part of the game as well. Now, what I will be doing is when I've actually finished all these competitions and we don't have to do as much anymore, probably going to do a couple of rounds of actually playing in the actual bar itself, selling off some good beer. I'll probably ask for name suggestions as well, but 
don't put them in this one but let me know what you think of this game and I'm actually considering doing like a big reviewy thing at the end and actually like talking about my experiences in this game if you want to hear that as well again I'd love to hear your thoughts down below until my next video live stream or whatever else I do on this channel thank you very much for kicking by this has been Hybrid Steel this is Brew Pub Simulator and I'm going to be honest even with its bugs it's still a pretty good game until then peace out have fun enjoy everything you guys do bye bye for now